What's up guys? It's Noelle here. Today, we're do- we're- oh my god. Wait, I already can't speak and I just started the video. We booked out this really cool house. I'm gonna take you guys behind the scenes of a little photo shoot. We're gonna do reels, photos, content. Bang, 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 bang. We're gonna bang it all out in like two and a half, three hours. I'm really excited. I've actually been waiting for this because reels are apparently the way to go now and photos aren't really as popular, I guess. They're just, the algorithm is changing up, so I need to get with it. And that's what we're gonna do today. And this house is like really cool, so I'm excited. What's up guys? We did a little bit of sh a little shoe action. Um, how long do we shoot for? Like two hours? Yeah, about. Yeah, it's been like two hours. And honestly guys, that's enough for a shoot. Two hours is like, we got some reels, we got some pictures. It's gonna be great. I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm just like really tired and also really hungry. Really excited about like this, these photos and videos, I guess, because the lighting in here is like so crazy. I'll show you guys how they turn out. You can see on my Instagram and stuff like that. We've been listening to Justin Bieber this whole time because that's how we roll. Justin Bieber, we love you. Um, now I'm probably gonna go get some food, and yeah. Someone's sneaking in. The camera. She doesn't like the attention. Look at her. Oh my god. Old baby. Come here, you old rascal. Anyway, guys, in my next video or two, I'm gonna have a big announcement. Well, it's at least a big announcement for me. You know what I'm talking about, Isaiah? And I'm really excited. Me and me and Bug have big things coming for us, right, Buggy? <laughs> Sorry, I'm like literally in love with her. She And she's in love with me too, believe me guys. Anyway, today I'm gonna be doing something that might make me gag a little bit. I'm gonna be reacting to my old content, like literally like first YouTube videos. Even though I really haven't been doing this for a while, if we think about it, I think we're coming up on a year and a half maybe, right? YouTube or everything? YouTube has been since December 2020 or January 2020. What, what about TikTok? TikTok's been since 20, yeah, since 2020. Yeah, and then old Instagram stuff, I pretty much delete, but we can look at my archives. I'll let you guys look at that. So yeah, I'm, I'm a little nervous, but that's what we're gonna be doing today. I figured it would be it's nice be for us to- of, It's gonna be a lot of thirst trapping. Yeah, but I figured it'd be nice for us to cringe together. Yeah, the TikTok might be some thirst traps. Nice. Um, it's all gonna be thirst traps. Every single one. You relax. No, it's a good one. But I'm saying I do even more, like what are you even saying? Because I do more thirst no, traps no, now I'm than I No, no, I'm saying like the, the dances, like the- So the, that's what I'm saying. It's not gonna trends. be that much different on TikTok, but it's still gonna make me throw up in my mouth. Because I don't even like my TikTok content to this day. So we got our Starbucks here. Plus, get out of there. You know she's a bad girl. Anyway, it is trifecta time. Right, Isaiah? Right, right, right. He can't eat it, guys. He just got his wisdom teeth out. You can eat salmon, Isaiah. I am, actually. So I guess I won't eat the salmon dish. Stop, Isaiah. I'm not gonna be eating the salmon dish right now. We said I can only eat oatmeal, fish, yogurt. Free soup. So there's yeah. So basically, I have a bunch of trifecta already like made, like full on made meals. Which I don't think I'm gonna go with any of these right now. The shrimp ones are the best. Yeah, the shrimp ones are so good. With, and like sometimes Isaiah mixes them with like bison and stuff. So good. But I think for today, we're gonna do the traditional bison and rice, baby. And for this, all I do, well Isaiah actually taught me this. You do the bison, you do the rice, you add a little bit of lettuce, then you add some like whatever hot sauce you have. And really that's, that's it. You could sometimes add teriyaki. Yeah. Ooh, or that jalapeno uh, sauce from Chipotle. Guys, this I've been addicted. I've been like addicted to this sauce. This is the best sauce yeah. right here. Wow. So anyway, yeah, I'm gonna just eat one patty, some rice, and call, this whole thing a rice call it a day for my lunch. I mean, I am a rice lover for sure, but like, I'd have to be really hungry to eat that whole thing. Guys, honestly, rice with salt when you're drunk for some reason is like guys, the best drunk. thing in the world. One time I think we were both drunk and like we just came on here and ate rice and salt. No, for like, it was like, it was, it was like, like three this. in the morning. I was like hungry, I was like. But it was like the best rice and salt in the world. Weird. 
But yeah, that is on today's agenda. Also, if you guys are interested in trifecta and you know getting your meals taken care of, because I know I don't really cook a lot, so this stuff really, you know, takes yeah, care of me. Yeah, thank you. Trifecta really takes care of me. So if you wanna be taken care of or you just want some easier, healthy, really good meals, link in description. Yeah, click that link in the description. But yeah, I'm gonna go eat some bison and rice and then we're gonna cringe together. Okay, let's start with YouTube. I was really, really awkward this day. Like, it was like one of those days where I was just like saying I was gonna start YouTube and I never did. And I was like, okay, fuck it. Like, something ignited in me and I was like, I'm fucking starting YouTube. And I was just like really awkward and like not ready. But it, the video actually turned out pretty well. I filmed it on my phone and my friend Haley helped me. Shout out, Haley. This video did so well. It's still one of my best videos to date. It's like at 350K. It was just an Instagram QA, get to know me. So let's, let's watch Action. it. Action. Ah! <laughs> okay, sorry. I've never done this before. Oh, my old intro. Hey guys, it's Noelle. If you're watching this, you probably know me from Jesse James West YouTube channel, but I finally decided to start my own because a lot of people have been telling me to. The reason I was gagging in the beginning is because I literally couldn't get my words out. Like I literally did like, I think a million different takes before I finally like, <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna, cause he was probably weird talking to a camera. It felt so weird. Your voice sounds so different. Yeah, I don't know why. It sounds like really weird. Kind of like a get to know me kind of thing. Here we go. Oh, it's kind of cute right though. In. My hair's Let's so jump right in. I'm gonna be answering like the same Simple questions first. Pablo asks, how old are you? I am 19 years old. Why did I say it like that? I was like, I am yeah. 19 years old. Like Wait. it was like, are you okay? I am from New Jersey, North Jersey. Um, someone said you should start a YouTube channel. Your content would pop off. That makes me really happy. Thank you for saying that. A lot of people- That makes me really happy. Thank you for saying that. I know, like, I don't know what I was trying to do. Here we are, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens, look where we are, baby. I'm living my dream in LA. Sorry, I'm getting emotional. I'm 5'4", almost 5'5". Five, five. Everyone thinks I'm like super tall and like, I'm just not. I'm like a- Girl, why are you getting mad? Are you a natural blonde? No! <laughs> my hair is light brown. Like I was blonde when I was a kid. My, my hair was so blonde here though. Does. Do you find tattoos attractive? Yes, to an extent. I love Justin Bieber with all my heart, but that still stands true and it always will. A little too much tattoos for me. I like a sleeve on a guy. Favorite place to eat, 100% Chipotle. I was a Chipotle stan and then I got COVID and it didn't hit the same for me after that. And then I moved down here and then I got super into Kava. And currently to this day, me and Isaiah are low key back to being Chipotle people. I wish I knew you as a friend. You seem fun to be around. That's not a question, but like that makes me feel happy. I hate when people like comment down like, Why do I keep saying that to people that say something nice to me? That makes me feel happy. Yeah. Like you're literally 10 years old. <laughs> I'm making myself cringe so bad. What's your dream first date? No, I'm like, I'm like a, I'm a simple girl. Like I don't need anything crazy to like be won over. I feel like walking around the city and then like. Yeah, I didn't know what I wanted to say there. It's funny because that's like now what that I is on not day. what I want to do. <laughs> I do really like nice views. And before we were dating, Isaiah took me to a nice lookout, and I was like, why the. F isn't this bitch making any moves. And I was like this. Come here, come here. He's so cute, he just got his wisdom teeth out. But he's taking it like a champ. This is my baby. I'm not a city girl, like I am. Like I love like- I'm a city boy. Though. I love it, but like I definitely would not want to, ooh, let's go take a walk around the city. Like the f why would I say that? I like the city, I'm a city guy. <laughs> it's too quiet out here for me. <laughs> Oh my god. She's causing so much pressure on my body, so making me bleed. Sorry, Angel. Oh my god, Christian. You're not supposed to talk a lot when you get wisdom teeth out. Shout out to Christian if you're watching this video. My friend Christian this morning was talking to me. He just talks so much in the gym. My mouth is literally bleeding. Man, blood all over my fucking mouth. And he's just still talking to him. I'm like, but I don't want to be rude. I was like, you shut the fuck up. I'm in pain. And I'm like, I'm not try supposed to talk and you shut the fuck up. Yeah, like literally, it looked like I, w I went down and like she was on her period and I was like, talking to her. I'm an animal. So fat ass. Do you play any sports? I danced. My like whole life. I always... You got so serious. I danced like my whole life. Top three most attractive features in a guy. Yes, they're asking. I like brown eyes. I really like curly hair on a guy. Not long curly hair. 
and probably biceps. Curly hair? Do you want to do everything curly hair? I don't know. I guess things change because I don't even know who had curly hair that I was like into. That's it for that video. What should I watch next? Reading weird Instagram DMs? Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's Noelle here. I'm back with another video. What the hell was that? Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. It's Noelle here and I'm back with another video. Okay. <laughs> so today... <laughs> Guys, I'm actually, I switched that too, I guess. What's up guys, it's Noelle here. I'm back with another video. So today, yeah, no, we won't be doing any of that anymore because I don't really know. Hey, thank you for 10K subscribers. I honestly Damn, can't... right after my first video, I hit 10K. That's, That's crazy. crazy. I believe it, that happened so quick. I didn't expect that. So thank you so much for that. Please subscribe if you oh, haven't. My cat in the back was so cute. <laughs> today, I'm going to be reading my Instagram DMs, the weird ones. I get a lot. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not trying to say this attention like I think I was actually prettier back then also don't really try as hard right now and I literally like like literally I say as like I'm like letting you guys like just see my rolls my following on Instagram is actually like 94% male oh it's higher now oh, yeah. love you boys voice sounds so different I know I don't know why now my voice sounds deep it's all the testosterone I've been taking I do it for the boys so without further ado Let's get started. I think I was, I had more of a fake voice, I guess. I guess I was just fake, not like fake, but my voice was just like higher when I got on camera or something. Or maybe I just hit puberty. It's not even weird. It's kind of funny. He goes, why are you so freaking cute, but so fat? And then he goes, far. OMG, I meant far. I actually get that one all the time. I think that's an actual like pickup line. Good God. The videos I just saw were whack and cringe. I agree, my dude. I agree. Um, let's watch. I took a trip to Miami vlog, part one. This one did pretty well, too. I got like 125 kitties. Damn, I used to pull views. What happened to me? What's up, guys? I am here with my friends, Meg <laughs> and Haley. I remember this. I was like super nervous to film in the airport. Like, I did not want to film in the airport at all because I was like so embarrassed. Actually, I'm still like to that, that to this day. I really haven't changed much. But I was like, what's up, guys? It's Noelle here. <laughs> My girl Haley used to edit and like film all my videos. If any of you can clap, I'll slap you. I remember watching this after and when Haley put that in, I literally laughed. <laughs> we, were, we brought our baby Yoda on the trip. <laughs> this was one of those like spur of the moment like trips where I was like. I need to get away with my girls. And like, I, we all had like zero money in our bank accounts and we just like took one of those trips to Miami. <laughs> None of us were 21, yeah. We landed in Miami. We can't check in till um, four. <laughs> and I have five dollars. Throw back to when I used to have skinnier fingers and I used to wear rings. Look at the beach. It's literally 30 degrees in New Jersey. Look what I'm wearing. <laughs> Fleece pants. I'm just gonna like walk around, do some sightseeing. Grab bite maybe, you know. Some of the things I'm wearing, I was like, damn, that's a cute outfit. Where the hell did that go? You know. So Haley just ordered a baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you okay? Oh, oh, jet lag. Out. Sorry, I'm sorry. It's yep. jet lag. I can't see. Like, <laughs> <you're okay. laughs> I remember editing this with Haley and we were cracking up. We thought it was the funniest thing in the world. Now I'm going to TikTok. It's probably gonna be, it's definitely gonna be like the same as my content right now, but I'm still gonna cringe. Let's just look at my first viral video. Yes, we all know why it went viral. <laughs> I didn't think it was gonna go viral at all because I didn't have any followers at this time. So I never, I don't even think I had a video really hit 100K at this point. It was my birthday and I was partying with my friends. I take the TikTok, post it, and turn off my phone for the rest of the night because I'm hanging out with my friends and shit. And I wake up in the morning and it's at like 100K and I, I went up to like 15K followers on TikTok and I was like, my friends like, holy shit, guys, like my video is like going viral, like this is crazy. And I was like, I literally thought that was crazy. So that was like my first video that ever did well. And let's look at another video that did well. Really just all oh my god, that's not. I was in Miami. Yeah, I was in Miami there. Let's look at even older videos. Oh, I got this running me. Kelly, you're dancing on me. She's better than a world. This is before I was on social media at all, that video. 
So before I ever collabed with like Jesse James West or anything, like I literally had, like I wasn't doing TikTok to get views, I was just doing it for video with Isaiah. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Do you know how hot it is in the car? No, <laughs> no I'm not I didn't. It's really the hottest thing. Don't get in the car. You have to sign a waiver. I'm not joking. Fun fact, you wanna, you guys wanna know why Isaiah won me over? Because I literally thought that he, still think, but like, I literally thought that he was the funniest person in the world. Like he literally always had me crying and we were just like best friends. And then I was like, wait. I remember that I day being guy. really hot. Hey guys. Hey Isaiah. Why do you have to look like that? Uh, we're here today because um, we're having a serious, you know, hiccup in this. Uh, in this relationship and um yeah so she takes wanted, it as a joke so um, we wanted to come, thank you for having us first we, of all. we wanted to come on and talk about it like, i didn't but you know she kind of forced she dragged me here like you know our platforms so we can get yeah. through this and be i don't think that's happy happened, again no happy. do you want to talk about what happened uh we had a um a very important um burger luncheon today she canceled on not canceled on me canceled on me and then was with someone else for five hours oh, yeah. Mm. I can't go back to those dark times. Mm. <laughs> the video with Noah back. All right, now can you do this? Are you doing the vacuum? Damn, that's good. Damn, that's good. Oh my god, he's so fake. Let's scroll down even more. This video was in Justin Bieber's Peaches YouTube video. Shot it. Kelly. Nice. Pretty bitch. I actually still look pretty after. Common, can you show them his hairy ass, please? Uh, is, I have a lot of swamp ass right now, so I'm in the air. It feels really good. <laughs> his ass, first of all, is so big, and second of all, it's really hairy. Do I mind? Absolutely not. I was so skinny. Can we take a moment? I was so skinny. Holy sh! Look at now. When people try to say I look the same, like I was a hundred pounds there. Want to know what I am today? One twenty. People can say what they want, you know. And now we're going to Instagram. Yeah, we are. I'm a little nervous. I actually just posted a reel. How's it doing? It's doing trash. Throwback to me and Haman's first pictures. This is the first day me and Haman ever met. Meant. Met. And the rest is history. So this is my first. I captioned it, love yourself first. It was a Valentine's Day photo. I was like, yeah, I'm single and I'm not ready to mingle. And then this is another one I posted with Hanman. And it just says, oh, hey. Damn, my photos used to do pretty well. And then another one. Those photos were fire though, actually. I love those photos. I'm gonna go all the way down on my Instagram. Of course, the first thing on my Instagram is something from a Justin Bieber concert. <laughs> Senior prom. <laughs> this photo, I thought it was so pretty. I think this is my profile picture for a while. Senior prom. I love, I actually loved that blue dress. I still love that blue dress. I did not like my hair or how tan I was though. This is also a picture from when I used to dance. Here, I'm gonna start scrolling, is when I really started, like I wanted to get into modeling. Like I didn't think I was gonna be an influencer or anything, but I really wanted to start getting into modeling. So I started posting more professional photos. Like here, and then like here, here. Yeah, I started doing a lot more shoots just because I was like trying to be quirky and fun. Yeah, this was, and this is when I went to LA for the very first time. My friend Jose took these pics and I still love them to this day. Let's go to my archives real quick. <sighs> Jesus, oh my God. Wow, some of these I don't even want to click on. So cringe. This is when I used to model for uh, 2016. I, I got 190 likes. I posted it because I thought it was really cool. I uh, modeled for a dance costume catalog and I thought it was like really cool. Meanwhile, like I think I got paid like $200 per shoot. Like it really wasn't a lot. They were called curtain call costumes and I love how my friend comments, hashtag close the curtain, no one wants to see you. <laughs> what is this? Oh my God, no, I don't even want to click on it. It's so embarrassing. <laughs> I was like, let me put on a full face real quick. I have some weird ass pictures. Like this is like me junior year of high school for Halloween. Like I had a full face on makeup on though. And this is my first year of college. Yeah, I was a partier. And that's really all I have to show you guys right now. First of all, I'm sweating. Second of all, that was a lot to take in. It's cool to see how far I've come though. I'm definitely proud of where I'm at. Only up from here. If you guys have been watching for that long, shout out you guys. No matter where you started watching me, I love you guys so much. Thank you for the support. That made me cringe a little bit, even though my content is still very similar, especially on TikTok. <laughs> but I love you guys so much. Read all the links in the description. 
thank you guys for the support. I know I've said it a million times, but I'll be back with another video either Monday or Thursday. Love y'all. Peace!